News 46 is brought to you in part by... Hi everybody, Sheldon here for the Pahrump Valley Auto Minute. We've got so many cars, trucks, and SUVs to show you. Here's just a quick sample. What about a 2009 Chevrolet Colorado? Regularly on our lot, $16,988. This one's only $13,988, and it has less than 6,300 miles. It's like a brand new truck. The next one coming in here is the Chevrolet Aveo. Over 30 miles to the gallon. Fantastic commuter car. Again, a 2009. This one was $12,988. It's only $99.88. Get it out of here. And if you've got something to tow, look at this. It's a Power Stroke turbo diesel, one ton crew cab, do real wheel, 04 Ford diesel. This thing's beautiful. It was $20,988. Mention the Auto Minute, $17,988. Come down and see me, folks. You'll find the right car. I'll make it the right price. Pahrump Valley Auto Plaza. Hometown service at a low, low price. What a nice presentation we had today. Uh, as you can hear the high school choir in the background, we've had several local bands. We have more local bands coming. The high school band's supposed to be here. We have all kinds of activities going on. We have 15 vendors behind us selling Christmas goods. We have free hot dogs that were donated by uh, Desert Snow, Heath Co. Company, Smith's, uh, Albertsons, Walmart. We have everything down here you need. Later on, the Nuggets bring in chili, uh, coffee and cocoa when it gets a little colder around four o'clock we have burn barrels set up the uh, buildings and grounds crew did a great job and of course pyrotechnico at 6 p.m ground and aerial fireworks display i know that we got mr tomasini right here from valley high school band like you're saying beautiful beautiful song tell me when people are wondering about the fireworks show this was all donated fireworks show wasn't it Everything you see here today is donated except for the vendors, and uh, we're not even charging them to be here. We want this to be just a very nice community celebration. Come on out and enjoy a nice day in Pahrump. This is something that you really felt in your heart you wanted to do. Very much so. Uh, you know, what we're trying to do basically is to collect toys for Toys for Tots and Rotary Giving Day so that we can ensure that every child in Pahrump has a Christmas present to open on Christmas Day. I, I drove past some of the fireworks over there, and they're getting all set up right now. And uh, we we chose this side of the park. Why did we choose the the baseball field over here? Oh, it's it's best. We can hold about 1,500 to 2,000 people here very comfortably. Plus, right in the middle, we have safety and security between field four and field three, and where they're shooting off the fireworks. So we have a plenty of safety, a lot of distance. Everything worked out for us really well. Plus, this is all fenced in, so we can keep everybody in one area. And uh, I know we have so many people to thank for this. Are we going to be doing this next year? Are we looking at it? We are looking very heavy and very strong at doing this again next year. And we have, do. We have a lot of people to thank. We, we're giving people an opportunity to come out here, and, and they're just selling their little knickknacks, mostly all Christmas-related. And they got some really nice stuff out over there. Symphony Animal House is over here, or Symphony Animal Facility is over here trying to raise money for their cause and they're selling they're having a bake sale and then we got uh, night community coalitions is back here they're doing face face painting they're giving away free hot uh, free popcorn and i also want to throw out a big thanks to rotary and to the marine corps league because they are sitting here all day collecting the toys for tots we already had one person donate 231 toys Wow, that is so wonderful. And I know that we got the Salvation Army ringing bells up at the yep. front. We got everybody here. It's just a great community event.